praise the Lord. It gives me such a joy to share with us a nugget from the Word of God today. And today I would want us to read from a story in the book of Genesis chapter 21. The, the chapter starts with the um, celebration of the arrival of baby Isaac. And Abraham and Sarah are very excited. But from verse 15, a sad event happens. And I want us to talk about Hagar and his son Ishmael. I want you to remember that Hagar used to be Abraham's maid. And through the recommendation of Sarah, they got a baby boy called Ishmael. But during this day, Abraham was very happy and he had a party for his son. But Sarah saw Ishmael mocking the son Isaac and she demanded that Hagar had to leave the compound. Immediately after a life of luxury, the following day Hagar and his son were sent away. I want you to imagine the emotions that were going through the mind of Hagar, feeling beaten, betrayed, mistreated, and bitter with life. And in the middle of the desert, she ran out of food and water. But praise God of the desert, that during that time, she was so frustrated, she kept her son under the bushes and went a few meters and wanted to cry and sob. But the Bible says in verse 19 that God called out to her and opened up her eyes. I know you could be listening to me and your world has been staggered. You have lost your job, you have lost your business, you don't know how to maintain your life, you don't know how to take care of your children. I've got good news. The God of Hagar is still alive and he is willing to open up your eyes that you may see the well. May the Lord open up your eyes so that you will live to celebrate. The Lord also gave her a promise, I'll make your son a great nation. And indeed, God followed up the word. The Lord will follow up his promise. He's the same yesterday, today, and forever. And he's willing to do this for you. May you live to tell the story in Jesus' name.